Hello everyone. Welcome to another episode of Plenty with Sulu. I hope you have already subscribed to our YouTube channel Plenty with Sulu. Today our guest is a leading business lady in Sri Lanka. She is the founder of Triad Advertising and Darana TV. She is none other than Varuni Amunugama Fernando. Hi Varuni. Hi Sulu girl, <laughs> if I may call you that. <laughs> you are. Yeah, I'm just asking uh, you now. Everyone knows you as Varuni Amunugam, right? But do you want to be known as a daughter of a politician or just Varuni Fernand? First, I have to say everybody other than my husband, because for him, I'm Varuni Fernand. No, it doesn't okay. matter. So anyway, I'll tell you why I. Okay, I'm born Varuni Amunugam, and I'm very yeah. proud of the fact. Then I have a double barrel surname, which is Varuni Amunugam Fernando. But as you very rightly said, uh, I'm happy to be known as Sarata Munugama's daughter, purely as the human being. Yeah, Not because daughters love fathers. Yes, we have I, such a special relationship, yes. my sister and I both. So for that matter, I'm very, very grateful and I'm happy. And I also have to say that when we started our company, which was in 1993, to get uh, you know, meet people, certain things, it did help. Not because of him really, but when you say uh, I'm Baruni Amunugama, they at least take a second look, second glance and they say, okay, are you so and so's daughter? And they might start a conversation. But I don't want to be known as his daughter for what I have achieved in my yeah. own right or as a team that we have built up together. So while I'm happy to be his daughter, I would like to have my own identity and also hope that I will give him a sense of pride as somebody or his you know, offspring who has brought him this kind of happiness in his life. That's natural, right? But the trade, the people in the trade always say you get opportunities because of your father. Do you agree on that? Nope. I completely disagree. Actually, that is actually a negative thing if you look at it because this kind of assumption, most of the time it doesn't come to me. I mean, nobody tells me directly and I'm really appreciative that <laughs> you're asking me directly because in my own world, I'm thinking it's what we have achieved as a company and I have a partner, Dilit Jayaveer, who's actually the visionary of the company. So it's what we have built up and my father doesn't really play a role in that except encouraging me and as a typical father. Yes, father's role yes. is that. But if you take of opportunities that I have got simply because of being his daughter, that is an absolute falsity. Because I don't think in any country, leave alone Sri Lanka, just because you are so and so is somebody, that people are going to just open doors. As I said before, they might give you that first introduction out yeah. of some common curtsy. But if you are some income poop, if you are not, who is not going to work hard and kind of deliver what you promise, they are not going to waste, waste their time. Yes. And one good thing is Sulo that I am happy he is not a typical politician. Because even in my mind, today's politicians have a huge question mark next to them and I am grateful that at least my sister and I we can walk on the street which are with our heads held up high because of who our father is and we see him as a scholar but honestly we have not got any opportunity because we are his children so there on a TV was one of your concept How, what made you to start a TV channel actually there on a was an accident. As okay. I said, both Dilith and I, we started this advertising company in 1993. We had no, we started with zero capital okay. and we were second year university students. So we had no interest in getting into television because <laughs> in our minds, it's such a huge thing, yes, you know, so the clear. investments and all of it. It's such an interesting story because it was an accident. Okay. We had a production company called Powerhouse which was supporting Triad doing television productions and all of that. And running that company was a gentleman called Anup Chandrasekara. He came to Sri Lanka from India, from South India, actually to join, join Sirasa. Things went awry there and that he, anyway, he couldn't work with them for a long time after maybe one or two months or something, something happened. And then he was desperate. Then he appealed to Dilip. And he said, look, I don't want to go back. I want to complete my stint. And then Dilip told him, look, the only opportunity is to head a production company. He is the person who found this investor 
who wanted to start a Tamil channel in Sri Lanka. Now with these gentlemen, we went to meet Madam Chandrika Bandaranayaka. We just accompanied them as a local communications company. And once we were there, she said, I am not going to give a license to a foreign company. I okay. want a local company who is responsible. So we just kept quiet because we were not in it to you know, start the business. Then Anup said, why madam, they are tried. These are the local partners. So then she said, ah, if you are accountable and I will give you this opportunity and I have to say because of her, actually we didn't have to oil a single palm. You know how things happen yes, in Sri Lanka, yes. but we did not have to do that because she intervened and she said, make sure this Sri Lankan company gets an opportunity. And with Mr. Ranaviraja, she gave her instructions and all of that. And when we started, we did a feasibility study and we needed 450 million to start this channel. Then, obviously, the Indian party, he said, look, I don't have that kind of money. I'm not interested. I'm going back. Now, we had the license, but we didn't have an investor. Okay. So, it was at this point in time, we thought, okay, why do we let go of this opportunity? We can start a singular channel. And we did a new feasibility study and we found that with 25 million, we could start beaming only to Colombo and the suburbs. So, okay. we raised a loan, we applied for a loan and that's how we started this company. Now 12 years later, the company becomes number one. But I think all credit to the team who we only kind of worked together as a team to establish. It was really the really Dilit whose vision it was to say, Ape de Rakagana alud de and typical, you know, proud Sri Lankan channel. So it's the team. They're on a team which has built the company to what it is. Because the question you answered already, Maika single Mahana, Demala channel patanga and gila single channel patanga. Have a Ogalam Vitra Goda Demala film done. Summer I criticize Karno, Vijay film done. Okay. I think the Demala Cham the Yapi Mama Lanka Vate Anakinek. Yapane Kisima Lanka with Singhala channel leka Kisima Kene Balane, the India out of Langa Hinda. The Mangodak will out of the Han Oglan Kohoma the marketing Karane, Moka the Oglan Lanka with market taker than the ladies at Villa Tin market taker, Moka the Lanka market taker than it. If make up the Ranek and Tika Kalano, the Moka the Tamil chair, a Tamil film penadi to it. At the Mangitani AK. Mangita ne responsibility ka apne denno ne dera na programs director girl ke ne chaamila dharma rasa keela. She is of Tamil origin and she studied in India. Chaamila hamat isse ma kiya na de atta mai hunga mamat pili gan na me rate demala singhala Muslim burg hunga katte ino ne audience ka kete de gatta. Apni singhala channel ne ka unat dera na films gatto. Ek e tiya na ingredients. It's action packed. Yeah. There is so much of entertainment and engagement. So the audience can be captured through that. Then, oh, yeah, there are no uh, films at the time that are entertainment. Pathing itala. Where you put a language pathing, but they may entertainment get at in itala. Have a channel like a carrier solo at the time. Oh, yeah, frequencies at the time allocate karno are doing it. Aren't doing. Have a ape at the time, ape parama arte, ape abuogi. There are no other channel like a patangan. That is a wonderful thing you know, to show yes. our Sri Lankan Tamil audiences around the world that this is their country as well, and there's so much that we together can share. Yes. So many aspects. So that is really our ambition, and we are hoping that we can get a frequency so that we can start. Oh, that's good. So now this sophisticated business lady today you are. But if you if you come back to your school age. I heard something. I just want to know who were you? Absolutely nobody. Nobody then and nobody now. Honestly, I'm just not lying to you. It's the truth. Because I actually am like a Ahikuntake in that sense. Because my sister went to this school called Bishops. So it was quite accepted yeah. and all of that. E Kale Sirimavu Bandanaika Vidyale Patangata, which was like a model school. So I was sent to Sirimavu from one to five. It was that ended at grade 5 and that grounding really, I think, helped me to, for me to be who I am. It was I went to ladies' college 
बिकॉज देर वॉज अ कलीग मई सिस्त टोल मी हपो मे गोडे अवनांग एवंडे पा आपे इसको लेटे ममत नो अंडे सो माय अनादर फ्रेंड ऑफ माइंड कॉल रामनी मोत्ते टोगा मी सेम एज एज मी शी टोल माय पेरेंट्स आरात मामा आई विल टेक रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी पर हेमत मैं मामा लेडीज कॉलेज के टिके पालवे नहीं आउट दे चुलो मटे माता का ही वह इंग्लिशी भाषा अब अभी अतर में लंका भी मिनिस्टर है दिया तो वी आर नॉट फ्लुएंट नो बिकॉज़ वी आई द थिंकिंग सिंगल ओवर टाइम हिल सो एट लेडीज आई हैड अ खास जो शॉक because i was embarrassed i was thinking this is now a bit high fi if i make a mistake will they laugh at me and it was my friend who was very popular who was a class captain who helped me because it was so beautiful because being the same age you don't have leadership qualities like that yeah. today she is a lawyer she used to tell when she was invited to play during the interval unless my friend is invited i am not playing එහෙම හින්දා තමයි මාව අර කට්ටිය ඉන්වයිට් කරේවත් ඉනිෂලි ඊට පස්සේ ඔෆ් කෝස් දෙන් අයි ගොට් ඉන්ටු ද හෝල් සිස්ටම් දෙන් මයි ෆාදර් වෙන් ටු පැරිස් ටු යුනෙස්කෝ එතකොට වි ද ෆැමිලි වෙන් ටු බ්‍රිටිෂ් ස්කූල් ඉන් පැරිස් ආයි අයි කේම් බැක් ටු ලේඩිස් කොලෙජ් ඊට පස්සේ ඩිඩ් මයි ඒ ලෙවල්ස් ඇන් ගොට් ඉන්ටු ද ලෝ ෆැකල්ටි හැබැයි රයිට් ඇලෝන් මේ බි බිකොස් මයි පේරන්ට්ස් අප් බ්‍රිගින් දේ ඔල්වේස් සෙඩ් අපි සාමාන්‍ය මිනිස්සු we are lucky we have so many advantages so be humble and grateful yeah ithin adathath mata hitanne mama kiyana pudgale kettatama there is a question ma hunga hides tiyanawa ewa puravanne ara anith wate inna kattiya kiyana yeah to be completed you need everyone exactly. right i agree on that because i always say there's no complete me yes right unless there are other team has to be there and they are little quirky traits are reflected upon you no very true i remember when you were awarded in 2015 you refused to take the award and said it's not my achievement it's a team yeah api tamai maker nathwa mama ne maker but in 2016 i i invited you be to be our guest speaker yeah. at the top 50 awards and i still remember you said something amma kavadawat badaginnen yanne naha nindata ඒ හින්ද හැම කාන්තාවක්ම ඒක හිතන්න ඕන. But you were not a mother and you are not yes. a mother. How you feel in the society about it because in Sri Lanka by masking it I work with lot of I do counseling lot of women the society want women to be complete marriage motherhood is a must. If not she is not complete. Yes. But you have actually come out and spoken it very I think you are the one lady I have admired on that area because I wanted women to be open. very honest and yes. open and genuine. So how do you feel on that because I'm asking you I'm, I I hope I'm allowed to ask I oh, told yes. you. Oh yes. So lo actually in my life I think that is probably one uh, very emotional regret because I mean I think a woman is complete by being a mother. It's it's a physiological yes, yes. need. Other that when I see a baby most of the time my heart yearns. Have I think mama hita hada ganna har it was a health reason but I am blessed with so many other things maybe my giving nature I can be a mother to many. Agreed. Eh ma kiyala I kind of think of things positively. Have I you're so right. whenever i see women or whenever i get an opportunity especially to talk to the younger generation i always say motherhood cannot be compared sometimes they put careers ahead of them achievements all that is good but motherhood comes first because api sahaja apen api hadilama tiyenne in that nurturing way you know yeah. whatever we do and if we give birth to children who are good examples to the next generation we have actually contributed so much e ekama mama dakina de as you said we have women have this challenge of are they complete or have they not achieved this have they not achieved that e okkoma sulo api ape hitemma daagatta oya yadanni api thamai no oya daagan api ma daagan hitanu ayyo api meka nemai dan apen kavurutta vela ahanna ne pirimi kenek ahanna ne why you don't have children but a woman will always you are not a mother they will la so that's yes. the thing it's not a man who will always criticize on something it's mostly women. mostly us yes. ourselves we put this kind of uh, yardstick and we think we don't match up yeah 
ek but i see in whatever you do you know your communication you always say api kavurut perfect neha habai what we are is good enough so be yes. happy with that kiyala and that gives me a lot of you know i always think i have a lot of synergy in that thinking api ek ek advantages u thiyena api da disadvantages thiyena bai ara honda deva leva api aragena if you can touch another person for the better man because you cannot say just because she became a mother she's happy sometimes the mothers i know say yeah. if i was if i actually didn't yeah. give the birth yeah. so there are good and bad the children that. also turn the other way sometimes and the mothers tell me you're so lucky you're so blessed that you are not a mother <laughs> so i get that every time sometimes you're so blessed that you are not do you don't have a husband to be answerable <laughs> so i know about yeah. it very well i really wanted to ask that question because there are young girls having this issue and sometimes they are leaving jobs because they are so, they say the lunch time is the most miserable time mm. when everyone comes and say oh you're married for 5 years you don't have kids and all that so they end up leaving the jobs So this is that's why I wanted people who are watching especially the young girls to understand if you are blessed you will have it yes and if there are opportunities have it but it's not going to complete you yes. it's who you are exactly. if you are happy with yourself don't let others to judge exactly and you you have to that self worth is your own thing what is your own self worth ekka prashnaya ke bai tiyenne sulo etana samahara ada ada kale kello they leave it a little too long yes etokota there are other biological complications so something which can happen so naturally and automatically becomes a huge problem so most important thing is now when we look at ladies in our own circles who have best of both worlds they are balancing so much ए वगे पॉजिटिव मे मे एग्जाम्पल्स मे लमय बैलूत देन दे कैन पिक दैट एस अपोज टू सम एक्सट्रीम अग्री यू वर्क विथ लॉर्ड ऑफ यूथ देर आर नॉट एम ऑल्सो यू आई थिंक दे आर यंग पीपल एंड ऑल्सो ट्राइड बिकॉज अपीज आई ऑलवेज फॉलो यूर हाउ डू यू फील लाइक यू नो वेन पीपल कंप्लेन श्रीलंका कंप्लेन सो मच अबाउट आवर यूथ but you are someone who works with me maybe that's the reason you are still looking very young <laughs> and you know energetic so how do you feel in working with i them? love them i totally love them maybe that you know unsatisfied motherly instinct in in me or something where i'm forcing myself as their mother but they are beautiful creatures because they belong to a completely different generation and they're who, genuine genuine and we sometimes don't understand so and we judge them the way we think but within them they are absolute beautiful hearts they are uncomplicated their ambitions are very simple they have a very socially based commitment they want to help other people only segment in this youth which i am a little wary about are these people who think that you know they 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 are they have an advantage or they 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 mukha do kata kiyanne that uh, they are born gifted yeah, yeah. yeah they they it's their right wage ekata weda karanna nathu just simply because we are born to parents who have means you know it's our inheritance that's, sometimes there's a wrong attitude that's a wrong attitude but i blame the parents also because as you said appita samanya minissu vidiyata jeevath wenna dunna na अगोड़ा कर लामाई तो एक दिन ना के वाल वाला था। नो पेरेंट्स है बिकम आल्सो सो कंपेटिटिव नो अरे लामाई तो स्कूल की हाँ मैं इन्द्र देने ना दे आ फाइटिंग दे आ बैटल्स दे आर नॉट लेटिंग द किड्स फील द रफ एंड टंबल एंड ग्रो अप बट रीजन कुड बी सुलो सी आफ्टर द वॉर एंडेड इन 2009 नाउ वर्ल्ड ओवर Yes. because after the war our generation also did well they started blossoming new opportunities more money so their lifestyles improved they felt that they should give their kids what they didn't have yeah and when like extended themselves to a point that they became a nuisance where they didn't let the children grow up on their in their own right yes. some some of course have let the kids grow and manage for themselves the other in in the workplace i always see now these millennials are coming to the workplace my age group is still there 
So there are two generations. Ape set ke podi recent mante ka tiye no aragol landi ida the ida. Oh, ape set ka thamata ka ape thamai yara digitalize. Ok, ma hadala dunne ape. Ape complain karna me gula laptop pe ke phone ke baat sa. Ape ne wahe dunne. The arma me hamati sme ke no complain karna ne pala ma ekena ape hada pula dunne kiya la. No, and that's what they are used to, and they are also very creative, no, and innovative. I only way is in in our workplace. What we try to do is to we tell them, be don't forget your human attributes. Hitta poga pa lang kara devices ekka me engage vela they become zombies no. Sometimes eh ma natuwa like enjoy relationships. Now in the lunch room enjoy that time to have a conversation, have an interaction. You know have that human relationships. Agree on that. So before I finish it off, I just want to know one thing about you. You are a sports lady, right? And also you are very passionate about changing things, whether it's business, whether it's the attitude or whether it's political. What is your real role in Sri Lanka? Whew. <laughs> uh, uh, first and foremost, I'm not a sports woman. I was terrible at sports, but I I try to be fit. Yeah, because I, I know cycling. You are really yeah, good. Yeah, Eva Okuma Sulu, not as a sports woman. Just I wanted to try something new. Okay. And you know, try and do things. People helped all the friends, and it was enjoyable. And what is my role? I think I can inspire, as you said, change. Maybe not like huge changes, but. Little little changes in the right places, where which is something you always say, which I've noticed, where we can bring in that passion, the softness, the nurturing aspect, the goodness that a woman can bring, plus her acumen. Now, perfect example is this Prime Minister, right, of New Zealand, where she's talking about empathy more than sympathy. Yeah. I think being a woman, we see things differently. Maybe we see things not black white, but we see the grey in it. Yeah. So my role also I see as somebody. I don't have to be that person who's number one. I can. I'm happy to be number two, but playing my role and being part of the team. So I think as in that sense, in Sri Lanka, if I can be some inspiration to. The future generations to think that at the end of the day you'll be happy no solo no matter what may oma jalta rida gana or if you are happy with if yourself you're happy by your own measurement yes that is the most important thing i agree totally and it was nice having this chat with you one it was a long time waiting because i have seen you in all the forums but i always felt it's so formal and i wanted to get who you out and thank you for agreeing thank you thank you thank you shulo <laughs> thank you thank you so much today we had varuni amunugama fernando with us and she said be yourself be satisfied with what you are happy with in your life so varuni thank you so much for joining again and we have a small gift this is for you actually this is plenty with sulo a cup you, for you and the tea for you i hope thank you will you. enjoy and uh, Varuni, this program is very informal program as I told you. So I hope that you go and watch it. Varuni, there's a cup next to you if you can sign with your name. Anywhere. Anywhere. Then can I have my own uh, collection? Of course you can have it. That's why we have given you a copy of that. And to our audience, Subscribe to Plenty with Sulo. Enjoy all our sessions. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you, Sulo, and thank you for playing tea with Sulo. Sulo.